So I found this really easy way to capture and record anything on my screen. It's called EasyVid. I got it at EasyVid.com. It's better than a regular video editor because it also records my desktop, any game I play, web browsers, anything on the web. And that's just the beginning. EasyVid is an awesome video editor that can do stuff like voice recording, speed control, screen drawing, stamps, face cam, and YouTube upload. Check it out yourself. The first step is to go to EasyVid.com, download EasyVid, install it, then click the Capture Screen button, Start Capture Now. EasyVid will count down and your screen capture will begin. Feel free to open any program on your computer. EasyVid will record everything. So now, let's take a look at what you can do while you are recording with EasyVid. You can use EasyVid's pause button to easily pause and resume your recording. While you are recording, you can hover over the controller to see how much recording time you have left. Next, let's try the draw button. The draw button brings up a palette where you can choose a brush or a stamp. Let's see it in action. You can stamp and draw directly on your screen wherever you want. To return to your desktop, just press escape or right click and the drawing or stamp will fade out in a really cool way. When you are done recording, click the stop button. Your recording will now appear in EasyVid's timeline. To move a recording, just click and drag. Editing tools are accessible via a right click on any video region. You can delete regions, duplicate, split, and the coolest editing feature is speed adjustment. Many of the clips in this video have been sped up using EasyVid's awesome speed control. Now, let's look at the rest of EasyVid's features. The new project button, it automatically saves your work and the Project Manager, where you can open and duplicate projects. EasyVid's Undo and Redo buttons work just as you would expect, and you can zoom in and out on your timeline with ease. Next, let's check out Voice Recording. Just click the Record Voice button. As you record, EasyVid shows a green bar to represent your audio recording. Next, let's add text with the Add Text button. Simply type anything you want directly into the text slide. You can change the font, the text color, and the background color. Once you finish, your text slide appears next to your other media on the timeline. But what is really cool is that with one click of the Synthesize Speech button, EasyVid will render a computerized voice for your text slides. Here is some text. You can import any media you want into EasyVid. You can either click the Add Pictures and Video button, or you can simply drag media onto EasyVid's timeline. EasyVid automatically resizes and optimizes your media so it looks great for YouTube display. Let's take a look at EasyVid's Video Info Corner. The first box is your video title. The second box is your video description. The third selector is to choose what category your video will be found under on YouTube. With the next box, you can select among EasyVid's royalty-free music tracks. And with the button at the bottom, you can add a watermark that will appear on the lower right of your video. Then finally, when you are ready to upload to YouTube, just click the Upload to YouTube button. Read and click through the disclaimers and your video is off and uploading to YouTube. EasyVid provides you with a direct video link and ways to share around the web. And there your video is on YouTube. A couple more things I want to show you. The first is Advanced Capture Settings. Click the Capture Screen button, then click Use Advanced Settings. Here you can enable advanced features like simultaneous screen and voice recording, transparent controller, capture area selection, and webcam recording. So this time, let's enable three of them, transparent mode, area selection, and webcam. Then click Start Advanced Capture Now. You can use your mouse to draw a box on screen where EasyVid will record your video. EasyVid counts down. Now notice that the screen capture controller on the bottom left is transparent. And there's our webcam. And one more thing. 
You can make an instant slideshow from pictures with EasyVid by dragging any images onto the timeline. When you play back, a cool pan and zoom effect will be added. You can turn off this effect so your pictures don't move by right-clicking and unchecking pan and zoom. Oh, and one more thing. You can use your own MP3 file by selecting Use My Own from the bottom of EasyVid's music list. And you can only get EasyVid at EasyVid.com.